Wow, this light is way too bright on my face. Hey, just Jay here, and it's day 17 of the Bearded Brain Space. Last night and this morning I was thinking of ideas to vlog about and I was super stoked about a specific idea. On my drive to work I was thinking about how I would present it. Then as the day went on, I just wasn't feeling it. I still love the topic idea that I thought of. I just wasn't motivated to shoot this video. Then as I was thinking about not uploading a vlog today, I couldn't bring myself not to shoot it. I thought of all these really easy ideas that I could do, but all of the ideas seemed to rob this vlog of its purpose. To be a challenge to me to create something every day. If the stuff I'm creating isn't a challenge, then what's the point of creating it? I don't mean to say that this vlog needs to be insanely hard to do, but days like today are the perfect day for me to sit down and actually do a vlog. It's now that it will actually stretch me. Today's vlog is about doing things that are difficult. It's really easy to do things that are comfortable, and it's really easy to be lazy. The path of least resistance is the easiest path there is, but at the end of it, there's not a whole lot of reward. Doing hard things is a double-edged sword. It's something that I don't really like to do, but at the same time, I love it. I want to do hard things. And that's something that my dad taught me. I remember one time when I was in the backyard doing yard work and my dad stopped and asked me a question. He asked me, Jay, have you done hard things in your life? And as a teenager, I think I just shrugged my shoulders and mumbled something about not really. I feel like most teenage boys are pretty much apathetic to everything. Or at least they pretend to be because that's what you're supposed to be. That's the stereotype of a teenage boy. And he asked me again, and he started listing off different things. Different hikes we had been on, different service projects and yard work. Projects that I had worked on. As he listed them off, I didn't really think of them as difficult things because they were things that I had accomplished. And in my mind, difficult things are something that you're not able to accomplish. But my dad convinced me that really, I had done difficult things. I had accomplishments. Doing difficult things is so vital to becoming a better person. It doesn't matter who you are. Nobody's life is ever going to be easy. And of course those difficult things are relative to your life circumstance. I grew up with a great mom and dad that provided more than sufficient for me. No, I wasn't spoiled, but I also wasn't destitute. And the things that might be difficult to me might seem like a blessing for somebody that has it worse off. And the same goes for other people. Things that I would see as completely easy, other people might struggle with. But that doesn't diminish the difficulty that it is for them that person. The important thing is that we face the things that are difficult for us and we do them. I think a great way to feel inadequate, helpless, and a victim is to never do hard things, never accomplish anything, and never take accountability. Honestly, I'm really glad that I'm doing this vlog right now because this was a hard thing for me to do today, which may seem silly to other people. Trust me, there's a lot harder things in my life that I've done than shooting a vlog when I didn't feel like it. But today, this is my reminder to me that I can do hard things. And as always, I hope this wasn't horrible.